So in this video, I'm going to show you how to attach CSS file to HTML. So now I have some buttons. So I have three buttons here and I have some basic styling applied to these buttons. I'm going to show you how to create a basic CSS file. So I'm on VS code and uh, on VS code, go to file and then we are going to go to new text file and right here, I'm going to change the language of this. So I'm going to click on language and I'm going to say CSS. So as soon as it's a CSS file, so I'm going to go to file and then save. So I'm going to name it my style dot CSS. So as you know, I called it my style, but you can name it anything you want. All right. So some people may call it style or whatever you want to name it. Just give it a name. All right. And make sure that you remember this name. So I'm going to click on save and I have my CSS file here. So now we are ready to move the CSS from the HTML document to our CSS file. So you see inside of the style tag, I have some embedded CSS. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select everything between those tags. All right. So you see I'm inside of the style tag and I'm going to select everything except the name of the tag. All right. And I'm going to press control X to cut it, or I can just right to click and go to cut. So as you know, now we have no styling applied to our HTML file because we don't have any styling at all. So I'm going to get rid of the style tag because we don't need it anymore. And right here, we are going to move that CSS here. So I'm going to paste it here. So right to click and paste. So you see, I have my CSS inside of the CSS file and I'm going back to my HTML file and let me zoom in so you can see it better. So now we are still in the head, but we have got rid of the style tag. So we are going to use something called link. So we are going to link the style sheet to this HTML document. So what we are going to do is we are going to say a lesson sign link space and we are going to type in rel for relation equals to two quotations and then what is the relationship well it's style sheet all right so the relationship between these two files is a style sheet and then we are going to add one or space we are going to type in href equals to two quotations. So between these two quotations, you are going to add the name of your CSS file. So in my case, I named it my style dot CSS. All right. As you notice right now, my style has been applied to my HTML elements. So I'm going to close it. All right. So I have it and you know, this is a special tag, so I don't have to close it like the other HTML ones, but you see it says link relationship style sheet, href my style.css. So now I'm going to file save and I'm going to save both of my files. All right, everyone. So we have successfully attached this CSS file to this HTML document. However, if you are building a full website, you will have to include this line. All right. So you have to include line eight inside of all of your HTML files. So you have to make sure that you include this line inside of all of the other pages. So for example, let's say that this is the main page and then you have another page. You are going to apply the same thing there. So it will apply the same styling to every page. All right. So I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel.